notice with your t-shirts, you sometimes choose one of your themes and make it into a t-shirt. Mm -hmm. What, which ones do you choose? Well, that's very interesting. You know what? This is the first time, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm telling you, this is the first time in many ways, my first solo exhibit. Okay. And uh, when we start, when we invited people, mm -hmm. we used the Cheney and Rosewood piece, and someone said, I love that thing, you yeah. should have t-shirts. <laughs> And so, that's a good idea, but how t-shirt? We should send the image to some company, and I said, no, let's try to do it by ourselves. And with my wife, we bought the whole kit for a screen. Really? Which I haven't, I never... I never tried screen I printing, tried that, right, because yeah, it looks good. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's something that, I, in, the, in, the, in the University of Columbia, I did some kind of uh, print mm -hmm. with the, like, I, how do you say, like a sculpting. Right, and it's linoleum or linoleum. something. I right, did linoleum, right. but okay. I never had any contact with screen, oh, with silk okay. screen. But we bought some of this, uh, the whole thing. The, the it's painting. like the frame, and then you have a net. Exactly. Like that. Okay. I read the structures, okay. but then it's starting to get complicated, and then I tried to have that piece, but it didn't look good because it's uh -huh. so detailed. Yeah, so you have to. That doesn't look good. It, it bleeds together, exactly. I think. Yeah. Whereas so, this works because it's just hair. But I learned that you can have a uh, gray scale in, mm -hmm. a, in a silk screen. Oh. Print. So what I did was taking pictures and working Photoshop and I put pieces together and I did the posterizing.